attention tonight about what could have made some 200 people sick yesterday after a catered holiday office party. 55 of them became violently ill. This was the scene Wednesday as emergency workers rushed many people to hospitals and evaluated dozens of others. Now both the health department and the Department of Homeland Security are investigating to find out what caused this meal mayhem. News 13's Amanda McKenzie joins us from the Maitland Colonnades office building on Lucian Way live right now where it all happened. So Amanda, any answers yet? Yes, Marla, the Department of Health says there could have been a toxin in the food because of how quickly people became sick. Now, that doesn't mean the people were poisoned. They say it could be a biological toxin that developed on the food. So for now, epidemiologists are studying samples from the people and the food to determine the exact cause. Dozens of people from a company holiday party were carried away on stretchers and gurneys after complaining of severe nausea and upset stomach on Wednesday. All of the workers ate foods like turkey, ham, green beans and stuffing, all catered by Kitchen Divas of Sanford. Officials say 200 people were sickened, 55 people were treated at the scene and 25 of the most serious cases were taken to hospitals in Orange and Seminole counties. Because of how many people were affected, this was labeled a mass casualty incident and Homeland Security was notified. Now that these people are being treated for this foodborne illness, officials are working to find out where and how the contamination occurred. What we're doing is a trace back investigation to try to find out the source of what may have caused this. The Florida Department of Business and Professional Regulation are also investigating the incident. According to their inspections of the catering company Kitchen D, the company has met inspection standards since 2013. The Department of Health says the investigation is still ongoing and it may not be the fault of the catering company. Anything from transporting it, storage of it, preparing it, and also serving it. Health officials say the food could have been contaminated at the office building if it were exposed to someone who was sick or if the food was left out too long. The Kitchen Divas Catering Company is still in operation throughout this investigation. Now, I reached out to the company and they did not want to go on camera, but tell me they have never had an incident like this before and say they received an A rating in their last inspection. Reporting live in Maitland, Amanda McKenzie, News 13.